So I am standing at Portland Nursery on Stark Street and I'm here with Mark and Laura. Now, Mark, you are with Little Prince of Oregon and you chose again this uh, year to be sponsors of our plant pick. That is right. And uh, so this week, this month, I've chosen Blatilla, which is a genus of hardy orchids. Oh, wonderful. And we are at Portland Nursery to talk with you about this, Laura, and, and tell us a little information on it. Flotillas are exotic looking and easy to grow for the garden, so that's why I love them. Um, very adaptable to a lot of situations too. And you know, I've always been surprised because the first time I heard about them, I thought, oh, there's no way they're going to live. They really are hardy, so what else do they really love to grow in? Um, they like to grow in sun to part shade, uh, well-drained soil and um, they tend to bloom from mid-May through mid-June. So they really have a pretty long bloom period, don't they? They really do, at six weeks. And then the stands can get pretty large, can't yes, they? Yes, and rather quickly, not invasively. They're, yeah. they're friendly spreaders, but it's impressive when they get big. So Mark, you are from Little Prince, so tell us about these three that you and Laura have picked out. Okay, so the, the three that we currently have in production are Blotilla striata, which is this one. It's native to China. This one is Blotilla Yokohama, which is a, a hybrid cross between Blotilla Formosana and Blotilla striata. Nice. It's a little bit taller plant, um, not quite as dark colored flowers. And looks like it and, has a darker stem. Yeah, it does. And it's, it's a very robust, it's going gonna, it's gonna to naturalize into be about two feet tall, nice. whereas striata is going to stay in the 16 to 18 inch range. And then there's a, this is a yellow and white flowered one called Blotilla ocracia, which is native to China. Um, and, you know, you can plant these all together in, cl uh, in clumps and just have a clump of each color. They're all going to bloom relatively the same time. And I love, too, that every nursery that, that has your stuff has the, the tag that you yeah, can clearly define. You can always print. find <laughs> Little Prince's tags. We have the crown frog on them, and we're... We're, we love our little logo. <laughs> and you also wanted to talk about your Facebook page. Yeah, go, go on to Facebook and, and look up Little Prince of Oregon and like us on Facebook. One of the things that we're trying to do is to create some energy between ourselves, the growers, between the garden nice. centers that we sell to and the customers. So, so um, yeah, do that. So, you know, you can go to gardentime.tv. You can find out what the plant pick is. You can do that by going to... Little Prince of Oregon. Absolutely. <laughs> and then you can find out also there where you can go to your favorite garden center and pick these beauties up. Thanks so much, y'all. Thank you. Thank you.